Firewatch features a delightfully simple presentation in which a rather complex and mature story is being told in a creative and unique way. Looking for a different approach to gaming? Firewatch might just offer what you're looking for. Some backstory. Developed by Campo Santo, a studio founded by a handful of members, some of which have worked on titles such as The Walking Dead and Mark of the Ninja. Initially, the development started when the lead environment artist at Campo Santo was tasked with translating a painting made by one of Campo Santo's members into 3D environments while maintaining the stylized and artistic vision of the painter. Story In the beginning of the game, you get to read about how Henry met his wife, Julia, and how their relationship progressed over the years. After some time, his wife develops advanced early-onset dementia, and this unfortunate event makes Henry decide to get away from everything to think about the future. To do so, he takes a job as a fire lookout in the Shoshone National Forest in Wyoming and meets Delilah, a lookout in another watchtower. Graphics Firewatch features a rather unique style of graphics not seen very often in games. The visuals are quite simple yet effective in displaying a world filled with a breathtaking landscape that is drenched in absolutely stunning picturesque graphics and detail. Campo Santo, the developer of Firewatch, has managed to design a world that is quite convincing and believable despite its fairly unusual style of cell shaded graphics. This makes the world itself a joy to explore and experience. Gameplay the gameplay in Firewatch is simple and intuitive. In fact, it's so easy, this is a game that could be more qualified as an interactive movie or a walking simulator. For starters, the game has no challenge in the traditional sense, there is no hostile opposition, no health and it's not possible to die. Yet, where this game can be qualified as remotely difficult is in the interactions you will have with Delilah, a lookout in another watchtower that serves as the game's main source of communication. And what a quality communication it is! Delilah is an intriguing character with many convincing traits and weaknesses. Because of her realistic writing, it's a joy to converse and learn more about her throughout the game. During your travels and duties, she will constantly talk with you, inform you of the situation and ask personal questions from time to time. The same goes for Henry, he too has the option to ask for advice with almost every interactive item and gradually forms a bond with her through personal conversations. Aside from this, the game features some basic gameplay elements such as investigating areas, exploring the landscape and discovering items and objects that are beneficial in your adventure. Overall score Fantastic voice acting The voice acting is surprisingly well done, creating a fantastic sense of realism and authenticity. Unique graphics. The graphics and art style of Firewatch possess a unique beauty rarely seen in other games. Intriguing mature story. The way the story in Firewatch has been written is great with a very realistic and believable take on human psychology and morality. Minimalistic gameplay. The gameplay in Firewatch is rather bare bones and serves more as a way to move the narrative forward rather than an actual game to play. The price. The price is too high for the short length Firewatch offers. Ending. The ending is rather anticlimactic and could make the overall experience a bit disappointing in retrospect. Closing words. A dear friend of mine has gifted this to me, otherwise this is the sort of game that would probably pass me by. Yet I'm glad I got the chance to play this game, because not only has it been quite an emotional roller coaster going through the game, it also provides a different and fresh take on the story-driven single-player genre. When going through the game it felt personally as if I was walking through a book with the option to somewhat influence the outcome of the story by the dialogue choices I made before starting and during the game, ultimately resulting in playing through a game that's rather unique in blending gameplay with narrative. Is it worth it? This is quite a tough one and is highly dependent on the type of gamer you are. Do you play games to be challenged, to grow in skill and dominate opponents? Well then this game is most certainly not for you. If you, however, prefer to experience a visual and interactive story, then I would say yeah, it's worth checking out. I would, however, personally suggest to wait for a drop in price to get the most out of your money. My name is Sir Dutchie, thanks a lot for watching, and I wish you, as usual, a fantastic day. <laughs>